spine vest, which is made to protect your spine only. So you have a, a VPD, which is a technology that we have. It's a hollow and dough technology. So if you touch it, you feel it's really soft to touch. But if it comes to a blunt force, you know, compacts so it stops the uh, trauma. So this is the spine vest. This is for someone who's maybe a skier cross racer or a border cross racer who's just looking for pure spine protection. It's lightweight and it's and you put this against your, your body so it goes under your, your face layer and you go under your jacket. So this is basically the exact same design as our adult version, the spine team for the kids. So this is you know, from just feedback from parents, they're they're worried about their kids getting hit by you know a large adult. I mean that's a lot of force to maybe a kid this big skiing, so this is full body protection that's made for Olympic X Games athletes, but kids can buy too. They launched the new Skull Comp helmet, which is a this is an Olympic racing helmet that's available to consumers to buy also. So if you're a high school kid racing and you want the same protection that Julie Mancuso or the other US ski team members who wear POC wear, this is the helmet they'll be wearing this year in the Olympics. It's Skull Comp helmet. 2.0, it's multi-impact, which means it can take more than one really hard fall and protect you. So a single impact helmet, if you fall once and it really, really hard, and it's a trauma, traumatizing fall, you should replace that helmet. I mean, so it's just a first job. So this is a multi-impact helmet that can take more than one really, really hard fall. So MIPS is a new technology development suite of multi-impact protection systems for the stands for so Helmet manufacturers have to pass a standard for the helmet to actually be sold. The standard is if the helmet falls vertically and passes this standard, you're good to go. But in reality, you don't ever fall straight down. You fall to the side where you're, you, know, you hit something, your head bounces off of it. The lateral rotational violence is usually what it's referred to. Uh, so what MIPS does is it Kind of, um, it acts like the membrane we talked about between your, your brain and your skull. So whenever you have an impact, your brain slides in this membrane. Um, so the helmet acts in the same way. It reproduces that same effect inside the helmet so that your natural defense is actually working in the helmet. So when you fall sideways, there's a pin right here that breaks. And it allows the internal shell to move whichever way your brain moves. So it helps to you know, that pin up? decrease. That's the pin right there. Okay. Cool. So you know, if you fall, you replace this pin, and the system starts over. Very cool. That's cool. Yeah, it's really really.